AMD news seems to be raining down from the skies today, so here's a couple of pieces all tightly encapsulated in one convenient video as AMD's next generation x86 and ARM high performance cores, codenamed Zen and K12, have been taped out. And this is according to the LinkedIn profile of an AMD design engineer. Now in case you're wondering what taped out actually means, I'm sure many of you are familiar, but it basically means that the final designs are most likely finished and they're now ready to be begin production, seeing what the yields are like and then going from there. Now, as I said, this is according to the LinkedIn profile of a design engineer, which was spotted by Matthias Waldhauer, aka Dresden Boy, on LinkedIn, and it basically says, quote, successfully designed and taped out various x86 and ARM cores, including Pile Driver, Excavator, Zen, and K12. Now, this basically means that it will probably end up competing against Intel's KB Lake with Zen looking to hit a release of next year. Of course, it does depend on KB Lake's release date, but it's fairly likely that those two will line up and end up competing against each other. But of course, that's pure speculation from me. Next up on the AMD platter is a rumour that AMD are making custom x86 SoC or system on chip for Apple's 2017 and 2018 iMac designs. Now this is according to a report from bitsandchips.it and this basically would allow Apple to get their hands on a high performance x86 SoC design at a significantly lower cost than any competing Intel solutions. Now as I just said, Zen is most likely to be out next year so at the 2017-2018 timeframe AMD will have two high performance CPU cores the ARM based design K12 and the second generation Zen Plus x86 design. And the report basically goes on to say that as the x86 ISA is a necessity in the high end desktop level Apple products, a Zen based design is most likely should this be true. And of course, I will link the source in the description below this video if you wish to give it a read. Now, of course, this would be a nice little boost for AMD as well as for Apple as it would serve as an viability booster for AMD's semi-custom business following their success in the console market as of course they are responsible for the APU of the PS4 and the Xbox One. And of course this is alongside the rumours that AMD might be developing something for the Nintendo NX so many whisperings going on right now regarding AMD. Very interesting stuff indeed and I'm looking forward to seeing whether or not this is actually true. I think having AMD's technology in the NX could certainly be a pretty big win for them and of course if they're doing this for Apple as well, that's not too shabby either. Thank you very much for watching guys, do let me know your thoughts and opinions. As I said, the link will be in the description below this video. Thank you very much for watching, I'll see you next time.